These are the top foods to detox your liver. Backed by science, I'm Zoe Reed, and this is Medicine Made Simple. Number one, avocados. Avocados are rich in glutathione, a powerful antioxidant that supports liver detoxification. They also possess anti-inflammatory properties. Here are some ways to include avocados in your meals. One, eggs and avocado. Pairing eggs with avocado provides a nutrient-dense, low-carb meal. Two, avocado toast. For those incorporating carbs in the morning, a strategy we discussed in our video on insulin resistance reversal, whole grain toast topped with avocado is a great option. Number two, extra virgin olive oil. Extra virgin olive oil is one of the healthiest fats you can eat. It's anti-inflammatory, heart healthy, and yes, totally safe to cook with. There's a common myth that heating olive oil makes it toxic. That's simply not true. Have you heard that myth? That cooking with olive oil makes it toxic? I'd love to know. Did you believe it? Or were you already team olive oil? Use it for cooking and in salad dressing, such as mixing it with apple cider vinegar for a liver-friendly dressing. Number three, cruciferous vegetables. Vegetables like kale, broccoli, Brussels sprouts, radishes, and arugula are rich in sulforaphane, a compound with potent anti-inflammatory and liver supportive properties. Including these in your lunch and dinner can aid in liver detoxification and improve insulin sensitivity. Don't worry about writing this all down. I've summarized everything in the free handout below. Check it out. Number four, beets. Beets are not just a colorful addition to your plate. They're packed with health benefits. Studies suggest that compounds in beets can help lower blood pressure, improve blood sugar levels, and manage cholesterol. While more research is needed to fully understand all their effects, adding beets to your diet is a simple and affordable way to support your overall health. Toss some beets into your salad for a natural liver-loving boost. And while you're at it, why not boost the like and subscribe buttons too? Your liver will thank you. Okay, maybe not, but I will. Due to their higher carbohydrate content, try to consume beets during your lunchtime meal. Aim to have no carbs past 2 p.m a principle we discussed in our video on carbohydrate timing. Number five, garlic. Garlic contains vitamin B1, thymine, and has anti-inflammatory and antioxidant properties. It's been shown to reduce liver enzymes and protect liver cells. Use garlic to flavor your evening no-carb meals to enhance both taste and health benefits. Number six, mushrooms. Certain mushrooms are rich in glutathione, an antioxidant that supports liver health and protects liver cells. A 2019 article in Food Science and Human Wellness found that dietary mushroom plays a vital role in protecting from immunodeficiency, cancer, inflammation, and metabolic syndromes. Now there are many different kinds of mushrooms, and if you're interested, I'll link the article down below because it lists all these different kinds and their specific health benefits. The point is that adding any of these to your evening meals, such as sauteing them in olive oil, can be a delicious and beneficial addition. Number seven, cinnamon, my personal favorite. Cinnamon is recognized for its anti-inflammatory properties and potential benefits in liver regeneration. However, it's crucial to consume it in moderation. Ideally, no more than one teaspoon of cinnamon powder daily. This caution is due to the presence of coumarin in certain types of cinnamon, such as cassia, which can be harmful to the liver in large quantities. The advantage of cinnamon is that even small amounts can impart significant flavor and health benefits. Adding a light sprinkle to your dishes or incorporating a dash into your morning coffee can provide these benefits without the risk of overconsumption. This brings us to the additional liver-friendly beverage, black coffee. Research indicates that regular consumption of black coffee may have protective effects against various liver diseases, such as liver malignancies, chronic liver disease due to alcohol, viral hepatitis, and fatty liver disease. For optimal benefits, it's important to consume this as black coffee. While a small splash of cream and a sprinkle of cinnamon are acceptable, it's best to avoid adding sugar, honey, or maple syrup. Excessive sugar intake can negate the positive effects of coffee on liver health. We talked about this before in our first video, and for a more detailed guidance on preparing a liver-friendly cup of coffee, 
refer to that video, How to Make a Killer Cup of Coffee to Beat Diabetes. I'll link it below. By incorporating these seven superfoods into your daily meals, you can support liver health and work towards reducing inflammation. And now for the question of the day. What's one food you thought helped your liver, but now you're not so sure? Comment below. I want to hear all about it. Like and subscribe if you like this video and leave a comment below. Until next time, everyone.